time in Healthcare for All's history, I want to invite each of you to innovate with this organization. I invite you to join one of the conversations that'll go on at the large canvases at three areas of this room and to help us focus on different aspects of patient-centered care. Should you have a conversation with a physician now, you may have a different view than later when you've experienced, as I did, these kind of end-of-life experiences with my own parents. My view has evolved, and my discussions with my wife and children have evolved. When we begin to honor patients, cultural values and religious values, we are honoring the essence of a person. We're honoring their core identity, what makes them who they are as people. And in this way, we can take a hospital and make it a place of hospitality. Having to make a trade-off between oral health care, which we know is so integral as part of your total health care, and saying, all right, I'll just pay for that part out of pocket, because the coverage isn't there. And even if I wanted to find out the price, not being able to figure out the price. So Massachusetts led the country in health care access reform, and we should feel incredibly proud about that. But the, the battle's not won. Giving people access to crappy care is only solving half the problem. Massachusetts is a unique and exciting environment in which to work on health policy change. We're blessed with vocal consumers, courageous community leaders, committed business and, commu and policy leaders, and policymakers who invest their personal experience and dedication in dynamic public service. To my good friend Amy Slemmer um, and Healthcare for All, I do listen to what you have to say, even when sometimes it's painful for me to hear it. There is much more to be done. And that's why you are leading the effort to make sure that the promise of behavioral health parity is truly real for every person in Massachusetts and our country. That is why you are promoting a proposal so that we can open up that black box of drug costs. It was so incredible. It's, um, so lively, so energetic, it's so much energy, and it's such a powerful night. Spend the time really trying to solve problems. I thought that was a fantastic way to really, you know, take advantage of the types of personalities and the types of stakeholders and representatives that you had here tonight. So I, I think it's great. I hope you do more of this.